Drones target Iraq's Ain al-Assad airbase with U.S. troops once again. The Iraqi airbase Ain al-Assad, with U.S. military personnel and other international forces, was attacked by two drones. One of them was successfully intercepted by air defense systems, according to Reuters. It is reported that as a result of this aerial attack on the base in West Iraq, there were no casualties among military personnel. No injuries have been reported. Two sources within the Iraqi military informed Western journalists about the drone strike. This was the second attack on U.S. forces in Iraq since early February after Iran-backed groups halted their attacks on American troops. According to a U.S. official, in April, two drones were shot down near the Ain al-Assad base. An Iraqi military official told Reuters that defense systems intercepted one drone near the base perimeter. Following the incident, Iraqi army patrols have intensified security around the base to prevent possible further attacks, as reported by an official army spokesperson. A U.S. official speaking on condition of anonymity said a projectile appears to have targeted the base, but without causing casualties, Reuters wrote. The attack occurred less than a week before an expected high-level Iraqi military delegation visit to Washington aimed at continuing negotiations on the cessation of the U.S.-led military coalition's operations in the country. In January, Washington and Baghdad initiated talks to review the reduction of the U.S.-led coalition presence in Iraq, formed in 2014 to assist in the fight against the Islamic State. Earlier, it was reported that in November of last year, American forces in Iraq and Syria were attacked using missiles and drones. It should be noted that since Hamas militants began their war against Israel, dozens of attacks on American forces have occurred in the Middle East. According to U.S. Central Command, these attacks resulted in injuries to 20 individuals. In response, the U.S. conducted strikes on two Iranian facilities in Syria. Additionally, on November the 21st, 2023, the U.S. carried out airstrikes in response to the attack on the Al-Assad airbase in Iraq, eliminating between five to eight militants. In April of this year, U.S. service members in Iraq and Syria were targeted in attacks involving missiles and drones. It should be noted that U.S. military officials have denied involvement in these incidents. Продолжение следует... 